Here we have the ground oriented brine unit traveling at 50 miles per hour using three nozzles for a total of 80 gallons per, per lane mile. Typical application will be two nozzles for a total of 50 gallons per lane mile. As we can see by this, a conventional unit has a disadvantage of brine backwashing and overspray which endangers the view of the driving public. The theory of the zero velocity brine unit is large concentrations of brine on select areas of the road where it has less chance of getting washed or wore away by the road traffic. This brine will remain on the road much longer and in turn will be more effective. After a half hour has elapsed and by comparing the two applications we can hardly see the application of the conventional unit in the left lane compared to the zero velocity unit in the right lane. Here we see how effective the zero velocity unit is at 50 and 35 miles per hour. There is little or no effect to the traveling public while still applying the material at the same rate. 